Good morning folks on the Isle of Lewis, Saturday. I'm on my stone sculpture left by the digger man, all power washed by me. Um, the tune of the day today is Fiddler's Joy. It's a gorgeous Strass Bay type tune, great fun to play on the fiddle. So get bouncing, get out of bed, get your day started, even if it is the weekend. Okay, you can sleep in if you want. Ready? hope you all have a great weekend wherever you are but if you're around tonight 7 p.m uk time me and gary will be taking to the end room we've got loads of requests we just love to see you there you're all welcome it's just so nice to have um an audience even though we can't see you but everyone's beginning to get to know each other and it's just great fun reading all the messages and the posts after some of them are just hilarious so please come and join us um I have a wee story if you're interested. Um, after my story yesterday, someone said, what about this one and a half points out of 40 for general knowledge in primary school? How did that come about? And then they said, and how on earth did this half point come about? Well, that is a story in itself. I had to fight very hard for that half point. Um, all the questions were kind of they were television based. If it had been about birds and hedges and trees and fields, I might have had more of an idea. The one answer that I did know was what was a clay pigeon. And since we lived um, very close to the moor and estates, and we would see the gamekeepers and they would have people out clay pigeon shooting, I knew what one of them was. But the half point I had done not long before this test, we had done, a, I had done a project on Jeff Capes, who was a very famous Scottish weightlifter. And I had had the opportunity to interview him at the agricultural show at Aberfeldy not very long before this test. So when the test came along, one of the questions was, what was Jeff Cape's favourite hobby? Well, I knew this because I had interviewed him and his favourite hobby was golfing. So I wrote down golfing. But the answer to the question was supposed to be weightlifting. Um, which was actually his career, but we won't go there. And I had to um, debate and fight very hard for my half point for writing down golfing because I knew he was a weightlifter, but I knew his hobby was golfing. So there you go, the story <laughs> of my half point for one and a half out of 40 for general knowledge. That's it, have a great day. We'd love to see you tonight. Please come and join us, bye. Okay, every time I said weightlifter, Jeff Capes was a strong man and shot putter. That was his training. Um, thank you, Colin. Standing corrected and just replace weightlifter with shot putt every time and the story is perfect. <laughs>